Hi guys, welcome to the nail studio. This week's video is going to be an unboxing of a nail art haul from Belissa. Belissa is a nail art company uh, based in the UK, but they do deliver worldwide. Um, if you want to check out their stock, then go to www.belissauk.com. Um, there is everything on there from flakes to sequins to glitters to foils to gel polishes. There's everything and anything to do with nails and nail art on there. So feel free to check that out. So I am a brand ambassador for Belissa. Um, if you want to check out some finished nail designs, then you can go into my um, Instagram. It's uh, at studio7 underscore beauty bar and you'll see some finished nail designs. I've always got it in the description of the products that I've used. So if they're attributed to Belissa, you'll be able to see that in there. OK, so as I'm a brand ambassador, Belissa sent me some of this stuff to have a look and to go through with uh, you guys on video and also uh, to feature in some of my sets. So um, each of these individual sections in here, this wheel doesn't come like this. This has been custom made for me um, uh, by Belissa. However, if you um, order uh, each of these, like so each of these sections is a full wheel that's available for you. So you can have a nosy online and see if there's any of these that you like. Now, this particular wheel, I think the one that's most pre prominent to me, prominent uh, for me is this Black Swarovski crystals. So because it's Halloween, I'm seeing a lot of sets with these Black Swarovski crystals in them. They're very, very shiny black um, studded um, sequins and you can get them uh, in, looks like small, yeah, medium and large by the looks of what's in here. So um, yeah, if you can have a nosy online and see if that's something you, uh, that you would like. There's other ones in here, iridescent white ones, um, shiny, uh, normal ones. They're all flat backed and all easy to adhere to your nails. So the next wheel I've been sent <coughs> has got, um, ah, this is cute. So these are uh, decorations for adhesion to the nail. So again, these are not available in a custom set like this. It is just something that you would uh, buy with um, each of these as an individual. Um, so again, oh wow, that one's beautiful. Sorry guys, this one's caught my eye. So I'm going to pull this one out. Especially because I've actually got gold on my set that I'm wearing at the moment. So, let's have a look. Oh, didn't do very well there. I don't know if you can see that. Gorgeous, really gorgeous. I love that. Very pretty. So, um, there's lots of different things in there: bows, hearts, um, like f I can never say it properly. Figurally, <laughs> um, type designs, heart circle. That one's also gorgeous. Very delicate with a diamond in the middle. These are all molded to ship to to fit the nail plate. So, um, once you've got your adhesive on there then that will sit quite comfortably on the nail. I personally use um, Ugly Duckling Stick It um, because I find it is the best for adhering stuff to nails. Um, I get mine from Caught You Looking. I don't know if that's uh, something that you have access to because it depends whether you're in the UK or not. So if you go to Ugly Duckling's main website then they'll direct you in the right place for a distributor for your area. The next wheel that I've been sent is Christmas things. Now there's going to be quite a lot on this set that's Christmas stuff um, because Christmas is upcoming. Uh, however, we as nail techs have to be prepared and get ourselves ready now. So again, she separated all these out, but I'm assuming that all of these are, are available in multiples for you rather than separate um, different designs like these. So we've got snowmen, snowflakes, reindeer with, with diamantes, candy canes, stag heads, Christmas trees, bells, uh, a little reindeer there with um, gold antlers. It's so cute. So all of these are so fun and I am sure you'll have a client in mind who would love to have one of these on their nails for Christmas time. Um, the next one is um, a different mix of, again, nail decals um, and diamantes, blues, we've got the fruits. Um, they're really in just now with the acrylic sets of embedding fruits into the acrylic. You can also do it with clear gels or with, um, if you're doing it like a milk bath, I know that people have been doing milk baths with florals, but I don't know, you could also do milk bath with fruits. 
um, and then uh, again uh, big diamond is that is not a flat back they are angled ones so the rest seem to be flat backs but the, the long ones here are not the flat back type they are the angled back so they would sit at an angle on the nail rather than flat but yeah there's loads of really cool things in that one as well just want to do lots of sets now that I've been sent this stuff. Okay, so I've been sent a Christmas holographic uh, transfer foil. So that one is Snowflakes um, with a black background. Uh, so I'd imagine you would put that on a black polish to get the best effect from it. And I think that there's a... No, it's just the one. Sorry, I thought that there was a secondary one at the back of, in the back of that one there. Yeah, it's just that one style. So if you want some fun holographic snowflakes, then head over to the website and pick yourself up a foil of that. Um, next is something that I asked to be sent. Um, this is um, for any Halloween sets that you're doing with Nightmare Over Christmas, Beetlejuice, anything really that requires this. A lurid, lurid green. Look at that. So bright. Really, really bright. Hope that's picking up on the camera how bright that is. So that would be really fun for using in sets that uh, require really, really bright green. I'm not saying I would have that as a full set on my nails, <laughs> but it would look quite cool in, in nail art. Um, she's also sent me these nail art tapes, um, so they're available in all different kinds of colours. Um, however, I've been sent the blue holographic, the silver holographic and the pink. So I hope that they're picking up on the camera for you. Move this light so you can see a little bit better. Hopefully that's picking up. Now if you can hear any background noise, it's my dog. She's a... Uh, not for being kept out of here and would have caused more noise than me just letting her in which I did um, so she might pitter patter around so if you hear background noise it's just her um, okay so these are the hexagon and uh, chunky glitters they're av available in lots of different colours um, this seems to be the pink and the multicolour the purple the blue and the gold um, so these are again really great for embedding into gels or embedding into your acrylic so really, really glittery. Hope that's coming up how sparkly they are. So the next two are it's like tinsel, tinsel sort of effect, um, which again will be really cool for Christmas sets. Um, seems to be just little bits. I think we've got a stray star in there. I don't think that's anything to do with the set. Um, and. You should be able to just like pick little bits of that up and press that into your sets. It's really cool. And again, this looks like mm, chunky uh, glitter. So again, Christmas themed with hollow through it, little bits of uh, tinsel and uh, chunky pieces of glitter. So again, that is quite nice. Hopefully that sparkle is picking up. And you can see the different sizes of glitter that are in there. So again, you can use that with gels or with acrylics. So the next um, bundle of fun things in here is the hollow, um, different sized uh, snowflakes. So I don't know if we can get in here. These are really cool I had an eye my eye on these when they were put up on the website can't wait to get my hands on them so they're in different sizes so there's some really really big ones that are purple light purple dark purple and they all have a holographic sheen to them hope that's picking up on the camera they are cool they are going to be stunning in some of the christmas sets and I have a particular client in mind, aka you, Leslie, that will absolutely love them and want them to be um, in her set. Menchie to Leslie. 
Okay then, so the next um, is uh, on the same theme. So these are also um, snowflakes. Um, again, kind of a, these are more iridescent rather than hollow. Uh, lots of different colours in there. So that would mix and match with lots of different coloured base sets. Beautiful. And then these are little silver and clear um, stars by the looks of them, or little paint splatters. I'm quite sure what you would call that shape. But hopefully you can see. They're not quite stars, more like paint splatters or maybe a snowflake, but not as detailed. Um, but they've also got a really nice shine to them, so they are cool. Now, these are absolutely, I know Belissa, Menji to Belissa, uh, has sent me these um, for Halloween sets. So these are chunky, black, and kind of blood coloured um, glitter pieces, um, which have got a kind of iridescent sheen on the top of them that hits off whatever blacks, purples, blues, golds, greens that it's uh, that it's catching. I don't know if that's coming up on the camera, but they are super cool and would look really, really good in some spooky sets. So again, it seems to be a different mix of graded glitters. So really, really fine. I don't know if it's coming up on my nail there. Really, really fine to really, really chunky. And that's available in black and in kind of like a dark blood red with blue pieces through it. Very cool. Okay, so neons now. So we've got some neon butterflies. Very cool. More for summer, but still really funky. And a uh, little um, pastel -y butterflies. And I think that these might be glow in the dark stars. I'll have to double check and see if they're, they're, they're glow in the dark ones. The website would tell you if they were or not. But either that or they're just the white snowflakes. Again, very cool. And these are iridescent paint splatters or snowflakes. I'm not quite sure what they would be. Um, and these are four leaf clovers. Not for a second they were cannabis leaves, but they're four leaf clovers. So they will be very handy come St. Patrick's Day. Very cool. These are autumn leaves all of, in all different shades of autumn. So gold, copper, red, just simply beautiful. I had my eye on them as well, so thank you so much for sending me them. I will definitely, definitely be doing a set with them in it. And then some more of the little paint splatters with lots of different colours. They are all pastels, iridescent, much, much lighter colours. So they are also very, very cute. The next set is, again, some of this is still Christmas themed. So Christmas, red with uh, blue and white and um, a mix of, with mixed in with iridescent glitter. They are really cool. That will be a stonking cool set with that embedded in gel or acrylic. I love that. And these are not expensive, guys. Like, oh, I mean, that will do plenty sets. Um, and, you know, you're only talking about a couple of quid for, for one of these. So perfect. Get yourself in there and have a nosy and stock up for Christmas. This is some stars. Again, iridescent and clear stars. Very cute. Different shapes um, in hearts and moons and stars, uh, some neon, some kind of pastel coloured. They are also very sweet. So this is another Christmas glitter set. So this has got Christmas trees and stars and like icicles and oh, could you get any more? It's like Christmas in a pot. Sarah, you're going to love these. <laughs> I know that one of my clients will be after this in one of her sets for sure. That was really cool. Absolutely love that. Um, these are numbers. So 
no, maybe they're letters. Sorry, they're letters, so you can spell things out with them. That's really cool as well. Okay, so I think this is actual cannabis leaves. Okay, so yeah, these are cannabis leaves. Holographic, if that's your thing. And head on over to the website and stock up on some of them. The next one is gold stars, holographic stars. Lovely. And then we have got some moons, some iridescent moons. They're coming up. And then rhombus. So we have the um burnt on orange hollow i've got the non-hollow version of that um so it's nice to have the hollow they're really 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 eye-catching for them i know that merlin uses some of this type of stuff in her sets i've done um um inspired by set that had these rhombus in it and oh the finished result was so cool and my client says she just kept looking at her nails the whole time like trying to catch an eye with them Okay, so flame nails are absolutely in at the moment. So these are the flame decals that you can add into your acrylic or your gels. Uh, they are available in lots of different colours. Um, Bliss has just sent me a couple. I've actually got the full set already. Um, so um, if you are into the flames, you can't find them anywhere. Melissa has them on her website, so head on over there and get them. And she's got them in everything from silver to iridescent to rainbow and she also has them in the leaf shapes so i don't have them in the leaves so that's quite cool actually i think that's like a, a lemony yellow that's got playboy bunnies on it as well and daisies and butterflies but i like it for the leaves so then and then I have been sent some foils and stickers. So that is the broken glass effect one. That is the marble foil. You can get some really cool effects with that. And this is the hollow leopard print foil. Really sweet. This is the Bambi. I don't know if you can see everything on there. Teeny tiny little Bambis. Very sweet. And then stars. Stars are very on trend at the moment. I've done a lot of sets that have included stars. I normally just freehand them, but I'm not going to lie, it would save a lot of time if I can just sticker them. So they'll come in very handy. That is butterflies. So if butterflies are your thing, or you have clients, that butterflies are their things, then again, there's lots of different choices of different butterflies on there. This is like paisley patterns. And snowflakes. Lots of different coloured snowflakes. Very cool. More snowflakes with some bobbles. And then some sweet Christmas uh, nail decals. So, your wreaths, your Christmas trees, gingerbread men, snowman, all very, very cute. This cuts down on time for doing freehand nail art. Or, if you don't like to do freehand nail art, then it would also be your thing. Okay, the next thing then is, um, these are water decals, so the last set of stickers are just stickers, you don't have to do anything with them, you just lift them off the sheath and pop them onto the nail and seal them in. Uh, these are water decals, so you have to cut out the, the decal that you want, pop it into water for a cup, but I normally give it about 5-10 seconds, making sure before I put it in the water that I lift off this protective sheath, and then um, you slide it away from the back end and pop it onto the nail and seal it in, and uh, Bob's your uncle. So that's got the stags, the stags heads, and some Christmas trees. Again, Christmas themed with the Christmas trees. I think I sense a theme here. I <laughs> think these are all Christmas. This is fab. I think all my clients are going to be very happy with the Christmas stock that I'm going to have. It's mandala type stuff. That's really cool. 
I'll do some cool sets with that. Oh, it's a bangle. Roses with kind of like a geometric background to it. Florals. Butterflies and florals. Sorry, I'll move this up a little bit. Oh, very nice. Look at that. Yeah, beautiful. I love that. Um, oh, dream catchers. Cherry blossoms. Uh, peacock feathers and butterflies. Um, lotus. Lotus flowers and art. I've already got my eye on one of them for one of my own sets. Some more florals. I think it was like Japanese type inspired florals. Um, flamingos. So pink flamingos. Always popular. Always super cute. Limes and lemons. Sorry, the dog is crying in the background. I think there's a fox outside. <laughs> um, and then some pastel coloured... Um, I don't know what kind of flower that is. I really, flower experts would probably be able to tell me. I don't know, but it's very pretty. Um, some birds, like so, it's like shadow birds rather than cool coloured birds. They're really, they're really um smart having the puppies. So we're coming for November. So if anyone has been asked to do um a Remembrance Day set, then Belissa has poppy stock. So get yourself over there and pick some up. And then an autumn set with some beautiful um, autumn leaves. Very pretty. And then again, some more of that type of art. So I think that that's everything. Yep, I've got everything. So as you can see, <laughs> there's lots in there. Lots and lots and lots to choose from. And this is only a small selection, guys, of stuff that's available. Um, on the website so if there's been anything in particular here that you've seen that you've liked if there's a particular thing you've seen here that you would like me to, to to put into a set and demonstrate it to you then give me a shout in the comments and let me know what you would like to see um i hope that you have enjoyed this video i'm sorry if i rambled on a little bit it's late at night i've been working all day today and i'm aware that i wasn't able to do a video last week so i thought i best to get my backside in gear and do one for you Okay then, well thanks for listening for um, this evening. It's a good night for me. Take care. See you at the next one.